hello guys welcome back to my channel it's already a month and i'm back <laughs> so guess what guys um today's video we are going to be making um woven back chain ignore my dirty hand i've been working 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 let me show you guys what i've been up to okay so this is why my hands are dirty i have some earrings some beach hat that i'm yet to complete I'm just making everything bit by bit because I have to get everything ready by next week for delivery. Okay, and they are all going to US. So guys, that's why I've been very, very busy. These are just some of the things I can show you. Let's get back to work. So guys, in today's video, we are going to be making um um woven chain which we normally use for our bag handle i have to make this video separately because in our next video we are going to be making a bag that requires this and to make the video short i decided to do this one separately before we proceed to the next video kindly ensure you watch the video from the beginning to the end okay so this is the chain i'm using a gold chain here yeah? ignore my tired voice i'm using a gold chain here and the measurement of the chain is like 31 inches of course you wouldn't want your fabric to be 31 inches as well you want to make it longer like add additional to it what i have here is 45 inches the fabric i'm using here is 45 inches and the width is two inches okay so and to fold it like this I'm to fold it like this sorry guys I had to bring it a little bit closer so you can see what I'm doing okay so like I said the width is two inches so what we have to do here is to fold this you can use your iron to iron it as in to fold it you can use your iron to to fold it together then you fold like this i hope you saw what i did the the midpoint is one inch so from that one inch just fold it fold it again okay see why you have to use iron so fold it again fold it a third time so the you are going to be stitching from here to the end that's how you are going to be doing it. So I'm going to do this on my sewing machine now. Okay, so on the sewing machine, you are just going to sew it straight down. You don't need to sew both sides. Just sew one of the edges, okay? You don't need to sew both sides. Just sew one of the edges, okay? So you sew it until you get to the end. The next thing to do is to insert your safety pin then make sure the chain is well placed you take it like this and just pull it to the end leave a little allowance so when you are placing you want to make sure it's straight from inside just like that you keep going until you get to the end it requires a lot of patience going so you are going to do it until you get to the end of the chain i'm 
um, you don't drag it because if you drag it, it will be too tight. Okay, it will be too tight, so you just make it lose a little bit. So let me quickly complete this off camera and I will show you guys what the finished look looks like. Okay guys, so you can see the process already and you can see how neat it is. You can see how neat it is. So you just have to follow that particular routine so you don't make mistake. Okay, so let's continue. Let's just finish it up together. So this is what it's going to look like by the time we are done. So this is what the um, woven chain looks like. So in our next video, when we are coupling the handle of the bag, I'm going to show you how to close how to close it after inserting it through your eyelet of your bag. So we are done. Thanks so much guys for watching my video. Remember to like, comment, share and subscribe. I will see you in my next video. Bye.